me and my kicks, me and my kicks, me and my, me and my, me and my kicks, me and my kicks, me and my kicks, me and my, me and my kicks. What's going on YouTube? It's your favorite YouTuber, me and my kicks coming at you with another outlet vlog and this one is the Tanja Outlets located in Howell, Michigan, man. Stay tuned. As always, I wanna thank you guys for watching this video today. I really do appreciate it. Smash that like button if you like this video. Also comment down below what's the best shoe you've seen in this video and we could chop it up in the comment section. Also, if you aren't subscribed to the channel, what are you doing, man? Hit that subscribe button, takes nothing but a couple seconds and you'll be notified of when I drop future videos. Now enough talking, let's get into this vlog, man. Got these uh, Air Max One Premium joints, and as you can see, it got that little like gradient look from maroon to like a light tan. You got some black tan and maroon hits all over it. It's pretty decent. But they got a charge 130, they want 90 for them. That's not bad at all. Got these Air Max 95s, gray with the blue on there. Got 120 retail 170. That's not bad. I got some more 95s right here for 90 bucks. And they got some 270 bow fans right here. I'm not really a big fan of this model. Pass on these, but they got these for 70. Since this is Michigan, they would have the Detroit Air Force One Motor City joints, 80 bucks, and retails 100. That's not bad. They got a nice little size run in it as well. They also got the Michigan 32s in here as well for 110 retails 165. That's not bad. Got the Minneapolis uh, 16s here, Feel like they got them for retail. And then they got the Minneapolis Kobe um, Pro Trolls for 100 bucks. That's not a bad price on these. And they got a nice little size run in this too. They got some more Kobe ones right here, 100. Some more Kobe ones right here for 100. They going crazy. That's not a bad little deal for the Kobe's. They got the Oreo Kyrie Fives. This is my first time seeing Kyrie Fives at the outlet. Pretty decent for 130. I'm guessing retail. Nice little size run in this as well. This is a nice deal in the futures. These are the future premiums for 90 bucks plus 30% off. Make them like 70, 75 bucks, 65 bucks. Not bad at all. Got these uh, 720s here. They look like this is the only pair they got. Say it's only available on Nike.com. They also got these. And I'm surprised to see these so early at the outlets. They got the Outcast uh, LeBron 16s here as well. Probably for retail. And also they got the 11 lows and the reflection sevens you already know these gonna hit outlets real soon when these first came out i thought this shoe was crazy man like i really like the rose gold hits on top of that gold this uh the victor cruz the air force ones i'm about to say what's the retail 175 i need to put a price on this because i know it's not 175 this should be at least 100 i never seen this colorway in the uh, mx 270s like black white with royal blue not a bad decent color royal blue can't go bad with that colorway. Finally, the Saturn 5 started to show up at these outlets. They got them for 140, retails 190. Uh, pretty decent, nice little deal off of them. I get these for like under 100 though. I wasn't really a big fan of the satin uppers, but if you want them, they're here. Got the South Beach 8s, they got them for 140, uh, retails 190. That's not a bad price on these. I got these for 90 bucks on the Foot Locker Friends and Family promotion. So I'm definitely glad I was able to get these for the price that I wanted. They got a nice full size run in these too. They got a couple of the Jordan Legacies for 80 bucks. They got the Olympic, the, I want to say bread joints. And they got like a Detroit Piston colorway. And they got a nice size run in all of it. So that's not too bad for this uh, shoe. They got these orange camo Air Force Ones for 80, retails 100. I definitely like this shoe. Out of like the whole little camo pack they had. I'll probably pay 50 for these. So hopefully I can get this for like 50 or, or under 50, 60 bucks. I'll pay for that. Oh, I wish these was on the wall, 20% off or 30% off. These would definitely be a nice grab. Never seen this color in the Air Max Pluses. These pretty decent. Uh, what they want, 120 for them. Retail 155, not bad. Got a nice little size run on these as well. They got an additional 30% off everything in the hash wall. So let me go ahead and check out and see what's going on. See if there's any steals. I doubt it though. They got the LeBron 16 Supermans for the 
what they got i'm guessing retail plus 30 percent off make it what like 130 140 and they also got the carry taco joints first time seeing these are the outlets got them for retail plus 30 percent off that's not bad on both those shoes got these purple and black copies these not bad 139 plus 30 percent off like 100 bucks 90 that's not bad at all i never seen these lebron soldiers it's a nice little color i like the strap it really contrasts with this shoe overall it's not bad over here at the um hash section i had to take it out the box it looks so nice i don't know how much they want for it but eh, they're not my size they got a bunch of the big sizes in these sports illustrated air jordan ones um what they want for them oh man that's not bad they want 80 bucks plus 30 percent off make them like 60 bucks man i need to see if there's some sizes for a couple of the big footers i know i don't see any for them but that's not bad though they got mostly 18s and 14s got these yellow 18s for 160 plus a discount make them like 120 ish they also got the orange ones if i could find them for around like 100 i'll definitely cop got the lebron um what these mixed with the air training ones they got them at the outlets what they what, what they want for them let me double check oh they want retail for them so retail plus 30 percent off make them like 140. Oh, that's a little bit too high for me. For the ladies, they ain't really got much or nothing. They got these MX ones, have a nice day joints. They got these MX 95s, and they got these um, Air Force One SF mids. But they ain't really got anything for the ladies or the kids. That's messed up. Got these gray LeBron 15s. Got these Soldier 12s. But man, it is very barren over here when it comes to the ladies. Mainly just workout shoes, really. For the girls, they got this metallic pink uh, Aero Jordan 1 mid. Retail price is 70 bucks. It's not bad for a little kid. Nice size running this. They got the chlorophylls for 100 for the kids. What else they got? They got a, um, what is it called? Jumpman Team 2. I'm like a black, white, and light pink for 80 It look like Adidas back up to his old tricks again. They got 50% off everything in the store. So, you know I got to go ahead and see what they got going on up in here. Hopefully, they got some Ultra Boost for the low. Got the i5 923s. Um, price is 70 bucks. So, half off that. Make them 35 Can't beat that. Uh, it's not as comfortable as Ultra Boost, but hey, we getting there. Got the Kansas Jayhawk um, Ultra Boost. And what they want for that they, they want retail so half off that be 90 bucks that's not bad for the jayhawk joints these must be a return or something because these just came out and these sitting at the outlets it's got to be a return but even at half off i wouldn't get these but these the the masoni uh collaboration with uh adidas they got some cageless joints right here i like this color it's not a bad color at all and what they got down here there's some uh, basketball joints not bad. There's some nice, uh, cute Continental 80s for the ladies. Um, some pink ones with a gun bottom. $80 plus 50% off, making like 40 bucks. That's not too bad. I go some more Ultra Boost for the ladies. Um, uh, I want to say these around like 75, 70 ish. Uh, they don't really have too much at this uh, outlet though. Kind of disappointing. All right, guys, that is the end of the vlog. What did you guys think of all the shoes that you seen? Comment down below what's the best shoe you seen. Also, if you've ever been to Howard, Michigan, or if you ever visited the Tanger outlets in Howard, Michigan, go ahead and comment that down below and we can chop it up in the comment section about it. And if you aren't subscribed to the channel, what are you doing, man? Hit that subscribe button, it takes nothing but a couple seconds, and you'll be notified of when I drop future videos. My final thoughts on this outlet mall, it's okay, like, you know, if it was like a star rating, like out of five stars, I'd probably give it like a three. It wasn't much major heat there, even at the Nike outlet or the Adidas outlet, but all outlets ain't gonna have all the heat. Like, if that was the case, everybody would be just at the outlets. But like, if you just need some running shoes to run in, or just some shoes to like, you know, go to the store, you know, just overall all around shoes, this outlet mall definitely had the shoes for you at nice and cheap low prices. So if you wanted to make like a separate trip to come visit this mall, and you live like an hour or two hours away, 
I would suggest you to like just save your money and your gas and don't do that. But like if you live 10, 30 minutes away from this outlet, I would definitely go and check it out periodically so you can see what's on the shelves and potentially get you a great deal in shoes, either for you, your wife, your kids, whatever. But anyways, that is my final thoughts. And lastly, peace.